<laughs> hey, what's up, guys? It's Josh here. I'm here with Coach Carey and Coach T, and we're going to go over this week's muscle minute workout for you. So for this workout, we're going to have five stations, one exercise at each station. It's going to be 60 seconds of work. You'll have 30 seconds to rotate to the next station. We're going to go around the room three times, and we'll have a finisher for you at the end. You ready, Carey? I'm ready. Okay, so station number one, we're starting with our TRX drag curls here. So. We're gonna be in that moving plank position, palms turned up, and what Carrie's gonna do is she's gonna keep those elbows high, use those biceps to pull herself up, and then she's gonna drag those hands down her torso toward her hips, and then lowering herself down. So once you've curled yourself up here, and you're bringing those hands down, don't let yourself lower, or don't let yourself fall down here. You're really squeezing, using those back muscles to hold you up and then lower yourself down with control. We got 60 seconds here, so take your time on this one. To make this a little bit heavier, you step further in. If you need to make it a little bit lighter, just put one foot back so you can get that full range of motion here. Nice job, Coach. From there, we're over to station number two. We got Coach T over here on the landmine bar. She's gonna be doing our landmine reverse lunge to press. So she's gonna hold that bar in her left hand. She's now gonna step back with that left leg then she's gonna drive up on that front leg here, using that momentum coming out of the lunge to throw that bar up. Deep breath in, go as low as you feel comfortable. Push that air as you're driving up here. You'll do five on one side, then you'll go five here. So we're gonna alternate here so you're not working just one side for too long here. Now, if the reverse lunge is an issue for any reason, just work that single arm squat press here so you can squat into it and press it up here. Or you can take that lower body out of it completely and do five presses on one arm, five on the other. We will have some weights here so you can add some weight to those bars as well. Nice job there, Coach. And from there, we're coming over to station number three. Coach Carrie's back. She's gonna be demonstrating our sled rope pull here. So. We got the sled down at the end with some weight on it. She's come down to the end of the rope. She's sitting back. The weight's gonna hold, the sled's gonna hold her up a little bit. She's reaching with that arm and then pulling, rotating as she's pulling here. So we get some rotation in there, bringing that sled all the way down to you at this end of the floor. Now, once you get that sled down to this end of the floor, you're gonna put that rope around one of those push poles. You're gonna push the sled back down to the other end of the floor. Then you're gonna hustle back to the end of the rope and start pulling again. So you're gonna try to get as many sets in as you can in that 60 seconds. And then wherever that sled's at, when the timer's up, just leave it there. The next person will start from that spot. Nice job, Coach. From there, we're over to station number four. Coach T's back here, and she's gonna be starting, she's gonna be demonstrating our kettlebell deadlift. So, get that kettlebell set up between those feet, chest up, flat back, little grunt to get those abs working, and then drive up through those heels, squeeze those glutes tight at the top. Nice flat back. Now, if you wanna challenge yourself a little bit more, you can add that second kettlebell in here, do that double kettlebell deadlift. Might need to go a little wider with your feet. That's up to you here. Chest up, squeeze those glutes tight. Take those extra breaths when you need to. Need to. 60 seconds, a good amount of time. Don't think about flying through this and getting a ton of reps in. Focus on the quality of those reps here. Nice job there, T. And from there, we're over to our last station. Coach Carrie's back. She's been doing our dumbbell three-point rows. So she's gonna get one hand on the box, She's gonna step back with that other leg to make room so she, is, she has room for that dumbbell. And now with that other arm, she's gonna pull toward her hip and low ribs. So notice here, she's not pulling up toward her armpit. She's pulling up to those ribs. That's what's gonna get those back muscles really working here. Push that box into the floor. Now again here, I suggest you do five on one side, then go five on there and just keep alternating side to side so that you're not just working that one arm for 60 straight seconds here. Challenge yourself with the weight. You can always make it lighter as you're getting tired here as well. Okay, that's our Muscle Minute workout for this week. Great job, everybody.